What's going on, everybody? It's by Paul Bear. Thank you all so much for checking out another video. And forget what you know about me. No, no, not that fun loving guy who likes to do a bit of fishing on the weekend, likes to go do a little bit of football, still supports Port Vale for whatever reason. Yeah, forget him. That guy's dead. Now I'm a hacker. Apparently. So, this is. This does look. It does happen. And when it does, it tickles. How did I fucking miss that guy, man? Like, I took a sledgehammer to the face. And yeah, me, Captain Hacks over here. Woo! <laughs> I meant for that to happen. It was all part of my scheme. So from now on, if I take any deaths, by the way, they're on purpose. I just don't want people to see my hacking ways. You know? Like, and if I get outdone by a person, no, no. Oh, like there, like there. Like that bitch right there with the rocket launcher. The guy that I missed about 16 times. <laughs> And then he got me with a rocket launcher. That's that's the fucker right there. You're a hacker. You'll start seeing it pop up in the chat. And honestly, it's fucking hilarious. But I'm noticing there are more people like this. There are more people who just throw accusations everywhere. Now, there's fucking loads. I'm in a Facebook group, right, for, for how much I use that app anymore. For people who play like... Because I, I used to like playing with people, to be fair. And I've been in it for years. And I used to like saying, oh yeah, I'll jump on for a few of you, blah, 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 you know, have a bit of a laugh and whatnot. No, not not so much, no. Fuck that. I hate people. Like, literally, like, it's like the ones that I've got in Lee. Like, you know, <laughs> they're the only people that I play with now. And generally, mainly Lee, though. Like, me and him, like, we smash this game all the time. We are, like, the game with a sledgehammer. Oh, I must have turned my hacks off for that second. And we are playing Call of Duty a lot, like a lot, a lot, and not just Modern Warfare 3, we've been playing MW2, Vanguard 2019, Cold War, the works, you know, we've been playing a little bit of everything, and it's been a lot of fun. But I still notice that there are people who get so upset when they lose, they lose a gunfight, and I'm kind of thinking, you know, you've got no god-given right to win a gunfight, it doesn't matter what level of lobby that you're playing in. Alright, you could be playing up against the worst people in the world, but if one's sat in a corner, and you run past them, and they shoot you in the back, you know what, they chose to do that, that's their given right, and they outplayed you in that situation. There's multiple times I've been in gunfights with people who are just spraying all around you, and they just get the better of you, it just happens. You know, you're in no way, shape, or form of any right to win any gunfight, you've got to earn every single one. And why it bothers me so much in this, here we fucking am, my palace suspicious cheating! I'm, I'm pretty sure he's just got them things copied and pasted and just wrote my name in first, my palace suspicious cheating! And he, he honest, oh no, he gets more irate than that, trust me, like holy shit, I had no idea this was the case. But I'm seeing it all the time, like you go on them Facebook groups and you see like people saying, oh Rebirth Island, cheater. And it's just somebody who's just slid around a corner and just happened to see them and taken them out. And I'm kind of thinking, like, we kind of sunk to that level of society where people can't be better than us. If I get beaten by another player, then fucking fair enough. You know, it's a game. Shit happens. Right there, there, all right, there, the perfect example. All right, let's build the budget, whatever. He got me a few times. Is he a hacker? Is he shit? He just got the better of me. He was, he was well placed. He was you know, kind of ready to go. He was locking down the line of sight. There was, there was a couple of times in this. Like, there was a couple of times I beat him. There was a couple of times he beat me. And it, it's just kind of the way of the world. And I didn't go, oh, he's a cheater. He's a hacker. I'm like, nah, move on. Same guy again. That max him. Oh, he gets pissed. I ended up thinking I said to him at the end, like, who the fuck you are, you little retard? You shouldn't say retard. Oh, fuck off. It's not saying retard's retarded. And I'm kind of thinking, I've been sat waiting for a game. For like two, three minutes. I, think I, I, I would have been so pissed if I died to him. And again, Billy Butcher. I'm just going to go with that because he must like the boys. You know, he's not a hacker. As my kid tries to hit the wall with a sledgehammer. Oh, whatever, go you. He's not a hacker. But am I going to sit here and moan? No, I just got out of a gunfight. He won the gunfight fair and square. We move on. But when I'm sitting waiting like two minutes for games of Vanguard. And then I get into a lobby with this fuck knuckle. It's like, why the fucking hell do I have to be with this little bitch? Why in the holy fucking shit can't I just be with people who are chill? Who just don't care? I mean, you know, we, we played this up. We had some rounds on a Sunday evening, right? The most chill day of the bastard week. And, oh, here we go again. Oh, no, no, no. It's coming. Every time I see that little orange thing pop up, it's usually that little whiny bitch. Get bent. I'm thinking, why the fuck am I wasting my time on these people? Because I usually just turn it off. And I'm kind of thinking, are we singing that much so? Are we singing so far as a society now? 
that we can't just have people who are better than us? Are we so protected by skill-based matchmaking that everybody gets into our gunfights with us? Everybody gets into our lobbies and we have gunfights with us, should I say. If they beat us, are we all of a sudden a hacker now? Because if you did the same to someone else, like some of these bitches, and they are fucking bitches. You like just take a death and go instead of just going, oh fucking wanker, knock me off my kill streak, whatever, move on. No, oh, he's a hacker. I'm gonna watch the replay. I'm gonna see exactly how he got me. Oh yeah, I studied there. How did you know I was behind that wall? Get fucked. Because I know it happens. I know it happens. I've seen it happen. I know firsthand that it happens. And it's like, is your life that pathetic that you are getting upset and you are calling accusations on people? Not in just a game from a couple of years ago, but any game in general, you sad bastard. You know, just take your fucking thumb out your ass and leave. If you're getting that upset about it, just fucking put the game down. And here we go again. He's like, I got a rocket right on target. Okay, just fucking leave if you're that upset about it. Just go. But if what happens if you are with the legitimate hacker? Dude, there is... Here we go again. Fucking... You missed, you twat. You thick and bred cunt. Oh, so he's cheating. Took it straight to the face. You fucking missed. It was barely in the same fucking postcode, you daft bastard. <laughs> like winds me up because I'm just like I wasn't doing shit. Me and my kid were playing Call of Duty, and I'm getting accusations by just some inbred fucktard whose mother's his sister. And it doesn't matter anyway because they fucking left him. Because who wouldn't want to tolerate that little fuck knuckle? Oh, die. Mm, mm, mm. I enjoyed that far too much. I get, oh, I got killed because I was in a bad position. No, no, it wasn't anything to do with me. I'm perfect. Hacker, hacker, hacker. Get fucked, nonce. And. Yeah, it just kind of tickles me that we cannot just play this game and just get beaten by better players. Because, let's face it, in this, I was a better player than their team. All right, not by much. I'm not going to sit here sucking my own dick. I'm not going to be like, I was the best player in the lobby by a country mile. No, no, edged it, edged it. Score was pretty close, did okay, didn't have an amazing game. But as always, I don't want to edit it out. I kind of want to show you the whole game because... We have games like this, we have better games, and trust me, we have worse games, but they are the ones I don't genuinely show. And it just baffled me, and it annoyed me. There's some little fucktard who was playing on his PC as well, because he had a mouse and keyboard by the bastard way. Alright, it wasn't just me on a controller. Oh, aim assist, aim assist, get bent aim assist, you fucking nonces. There's something wrong with them lot as well, let me tell you, holy shit. They want all the majority of cheating that does happen, and it's nowhere near as much as you think. Like I said, they ban like thousands of accounts every month out of millions and millions of players. The percentage actually isn't too bad. But yeah, it's them the ones who are the problem. But yeah, nonetheless, he's on his little mouse and keyboard, but yet calling accusations to everybody else. So as this kill cam winds down and we only have to go through all the excess nonsense of we have to get put in again, he's giving it the big one in the chat. Oh, I found it. Cheats! Cheats! Don't die! You fucking missed, you twat! Watch it back. I hope he sees the video and he's like, oh fucking hell, I am an absolute inbred cunt. Choke on your own fart. I, I don't usually bite to these. But, um, yes. Oh my god, what the fuck is up with you? I think I'm pretty sure he's saying, you missed. And I'm like, you little retard. <laughs> Can't say retard. Yeah, not being able to say retard is retarded. I hope he fucking read that, and I hope he gets bent, little twat. He is a proper inbred fucktard, though. Or oh, maybe he's not. Maybe he's telling the truth. All of a sudden, I'm the master hacker who barely knows how to work a calculator.